Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today I am coming to you with another haul video. Um, probably should expect a haul video every week, every other week. <sighs> Lord, I've been doing some major shopping. Anyway, um, this is the rest of the stuff that I had alluded to in my last Ulta haul that I did. So I did leave my sign up saying Ulta haul, um, but there's more products than that came from Ulta. But some of it that I didn't get at Ulta, you can get at Ulta. See what I'm saying? Anyway, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, I think we're going to move into the items that I got at Ulta. Um, some of them were from the 21 Days of Beauty. One being this oil here. And this is pronounced Nikeo. Nikeo. I never heard of this brand and it was one of their 21 Days of Beauty so it was like half off. But it's a anti-aging oil. And it looks like this here. It had really good reviews. And I just opened this last night because I was have used up an oil a face oil and the first thing when I opened it I was saying oh this smells like castor oil and the very first ingredient in this is castor oil I was just like man really so I don't know if I'm gonna like this or not just based on that alone I mean it had good reviews as far as a really nice anti-aging oil but I don't know just don't know because I can I can definitely smell that castor oil in there so but it doesn't have any mineral oil in it and it had um, gosh it had a whole bunch of other different oils in it that are really really good for the skin and there's a couple of oils that um, Mankati and Mafra that is from Africa it's grown in Africa or found in Africa that has been used for years and years and years and years um, for um, skin care properties you know it's for good for the skin so i don't know i don't know if i'm going to like this or not i just wished it didn't have that castor oil in there but anyway i did get that so i'll i'll report back i'll use it for a little while and see what i think on this Also from Ulta, I did order online the Juriva, Juriva, um, Juvia, Juvia's, Juvia's. From Ulta, I did order from Juvia's Place a liquid lipstick, and this one is called Afrek, Afrek. First of all, you gotta love the packaging of all of the Ju Juvia Way, Juvia's Place. <laughs> I'm having a hard time with that word. Um, their packaging is just so pretty but here's the lipstick and I don't have it on I should have but anyway I'll swatch it for you there's a swatch of it just a really pretty red <laughs> orangey red so I ordered that and there's there's a reason why I ordered this so I have that and then also from the Ulta website I got a blush from Ju Juvia's Place and this one is in Afrique, Afrique, I think is how you pronounce that. I think, I think, I think. Afrique. And again, the packaging is just so pretty. Just so pretty. I love these colors. The pinks and the greens together. Anyway, this is what it looks like. I've used it. This is just more of a, like a coral color. Definitely nice for summer. There's that. Everything's going to swatch really, really dark <laughs> because of that oil that's on my hand. But there it is right there. So it's really pretty. And then um, these other things that I ordered, um, I didn't order them from Ulta, but you can get them at Ulta. Anyway, Ju 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 Juvia's Place. Juvia's Place was doing a back to school um, special sale. <laughs> back to school specials. Who remembers back to school specials? I do. 
Does anybody else remember? They don't do they do back to school specials anymore? I don't know. Anyway, they were having a sale. Well, it was seventy. Was it seventy percent off or was it forty percent off? It was forty percent off. Anyway, they had a bundle of um, eyeshadows, and so I bought the bundle. There was actually six, and I let my daughter pick the ones that she wanted. So she has hers, and then this is what I have. These are so cool. Oh my gosh! I I now want a ton of juve. Juvia's Place um, eyeshadows. I do. So that's why I ordered the lipstick and the blush because I wanted, you know, I wanted to create a whole look with the brand as much as possible. And so I got, there's another blush on the Ulta website that I want to get um, next time that there's a sale or I need, I need something to put into the cart. Anyway, so this is the Nubian, and this is what it looks like. So pretty, and of course, you, you gotta love the packaging, just the artwork on these palettes. It's a cardboard palette, you know. Oh, they are so pretty, and I have so much light using these. Um, had been using them quite regularly until I got that Safari palette. But look, I mean, for the price, for the price, you cannot beat that. And I just seen on, was it Tim Talia's Instagram account where there's like 500 Ulta stores that are carrying this in stock now in store, the Juvia's Place, whereas before it was only online. Unfortunately, not any here in Oklahoma, but that's okay. And then there's the Masquerade Mini. I don't know why it's called the mini because, well, maybe because the eyeshadows are small, but look at those colors. <laughs> oh, yes, 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 yes. For spring and summer, they are going to be so pretty. And of course, there's some colors like right in here that I could do now for fall, you know. Shoot, I could do these colors for fall. I mean, it's not like... I'm going to get a ticket or something, you know, <laughs> from the eyeshadow police <laughs> saying you can't wear those this time of year. Anyway, so that was the mini masquerade palette. And then here's the Saharian. Oh, again, just so pretty. And the pigmentation on these is just, I mean, you can tell, I mean, look, you know, it's just perfect. Perfect. They're so pretty. Now I want there was a there's a new one that they're just coming out with too. I forgot what it was called. But can you see? Oh. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And then the last one I have is the Nubian 2. The Nubian 2. And it has these colors in it. Of course, these are like bigger pans, but oh, these you definitely fall. Definitely, definitely, definitely fall. Like this color right here, this kind of yellowy gold color. I love that color. I do. Let me put it right here. Look at that. Mm, that's so pretty. So I did get those. I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes to play with. A lot of new eyeshadows. I've just gone crazy over eyeshadows here lately. I tell you what, these these Ulta makeup wipes are poo. Do not buy these. They are absolute poo. They were free. I didn't buy them. They were in a little freebie. Good thing. Yeah, don't get those. They don't work very good. One of the other products that I got during the 21 Days of Beauty was a some new um, brush heads for my Clarisonic. And I end up getting the Radiance because they don't carry at Sephora, or not Sephora, Ulta, the, um, the cashmere one. So I got these. They were half price. So I got, I actually got four of them. And 
had to do two orders to get the four ones on my brush head, but they are, they're better than the ones that I was using. Those were just tearing at my face. And I think they were just the regular ones, but these are a lot better. I still like the, the cashmere one better, but this will be fine to get me by until there's a really good sell on the cashmere one. I mean, for half off, you couldn't beat that. You couldn't beat that price. So, and I had went in to my Ulta store like the day before those were supposed to be on sale to fill all of them to make sure that I was going to be okay with that one. And that one I think is going to be fine. Well, I know it's fine because I have one on my brush right now. Okay, then I have some products that I ordered from from Wee Dad. Wee Dad is a a line of hair care products that's specially formulated for curly hair. Um, the creator, the founder, has natural curly hair, and she felt like there was a need for specific products um, that would address the needs of curly hair. And if I'm not mistaken, I think she was probably one of the first brands to actually come out with products specifically for curly hair that's just all curly hair. Because I know Wee Dad was out before the Diva Curl or before any of those other ones. But anyway, um, the, on the website they were doing a sale on their leaders and that's when I like to order my gel. Um, you can get this gel at Ulta, but you can't get the liter size of it. And it's the Curl Quencher Moisturizing Style Gel. So I got, I actually got two of these. And then I also got the liter size of the conditioner and the shampoo that is in this line, which is the Curl Quencher, Curl Quencher Moisturizing Shampoo and Conditioner. It's in my shower. I've had a lot of people ask me here lately what I've been doing different with my hair, what I've been using on my curls, and this is the main things that I have been using. I've been using the gel for years and years and years and years, but I kind of float around and um, try different shampoos and conditioners, and uh, I just wasn't, I just wasn't satisfied with those shampoos and conditioners. So I thought, why don't I just try from the brand of the the gel that I know that I love and have used for years and years and years and years. So got that so I got all of that I think I ended up with four liters a shampoo a conditioner and two gels and then some of the free things that I got with that order was one a brand new um, shower comb from Wee Dad which I was needing a comb to use in the shower and also it had the ultra nourishing intense hydrating mask was a free gift and this is like two fluid ounces then there was the ultra nourishing cleansing oil a deluxe travel size and then the moisture lock leave-in conditioner a little travel size of it and then some little foil packets of the moisture lock leave-in conditioner and another moisture lock leave-in conditioner so a couple of those some good little freebies for placing those orders and then the last thing I have is from a website website called Timeless, and they have a lot of different skincare. I heard about them from Angie from Hot and Flashy, and they're very reasonable in price um, because they kind of cut out the middleman. They're just sold directly off of their website. So I got two different ones that she had recommend, um, recommended. One is the Matrixel 3000 Serum, and um, she recommend using this with in conjunction with a, a retinol and it kind of helps to one make the retinol work a little better and two help reduce the irritation that you could possibly get from using a retinol product which was what I was getting so I have been using this and I have been very pleased with the results so far and then the next one that I got is a vitamin C and this is the 20 percent vitamin C serum plus vitamin E and ferulic acid and I get get this this bottle but this bottle is in 
my ice box and the other bottles in my medicine cabinet so I'm not going to actually show you the products but I did get those I'll be doing an upcoming video um, talking about vitamin C and the benefits of vitamin C and the products that I use and how to incorporate vitamin C into your skincare regime so that's going to be coming up here pretty soon okay so that is it for the rest of the haul yay I can finally get all this stuff put up and um that would be it probably for a couple weeks at least. I don't have anything coming as far as what I've bought. Um, I do have some PR products coming. I'm going to be doing a specific review and um, video on a specific brand. So I'll be looking for that. That's on the Pure um, Cosmetics. Then my vitamin C video coming up. Um, probably the next video after this one, though, is going to be my top five maybe six um, fall perfumes or scents to wear for fall and winter so be looking for that anyway thank you so much for joining me i hope that you have enjoyed and i will be talking to you soon